Please subscribe to us. What's up, everyone? Hasib here from H4 Gadgets, and we are showing you Red Snow or Jailbreak for Windows and Mac. This works for both. We are doing it on Windows. So it's 0 0.9.9 .9 beta 9 is out, bringing the jailbreak for the AGB iPhone 4 and more. So we will need to run it as administrator. This should come up. We will need to click on jailbreak and then click on next. Should take us to this screen where we would need to put our phone into DFU. We would need to plug in the power cable and turn this off. And the power cable should be plugged in your PC, surely. So hold the power button for one two three now hold the home button and ten nine eight seven six five four three two one let go of the power button and keep holding the home button until your pc detects your phone now by the way it's an untethered jailbreak for ios 5.0.1 on iphone 3gs so you can get it untethered now this jailbreak fixes lots of stuff and the process should begin onto your PC and it would take about a minute or two to complete. We have forward this, we have speeded up the video so it, we, you, we could make it easier for you guys. So right now the process is going on. Meanwhile you can download the stuff while watching this video and prepare for the jailbreak. And unlock video is really coming really really soon so Stay tuned and hit the awesome subscribe button and like this video if you feel like being awesome. So next we will need to choose install Cydia and the upload on the RAM disk should begin and it should take a little bit of time, not a lot. And then it would patch the kernel. Now the big thing about this is we do not need any of the software selection which is was in big hectic in the previous versions of Red Snow so they have completely removed that. Now on the phone, you would get the metric, first of all you would get the downloading, jailbreak data, followed by the metrics mode, and the metrics mode would be followed by the uh, pineapple running. So the pineapple running should come up and this would take the most of the part in the jailbreak process. And then you should get the Apple logo once this is done. The Apple logo should come up and you should be up and running in a few minutes. So, once you're up, you would need to power off your device to do a tethered boot. So, we would need to power it off. On the Red Snow, we would need to choose Just Boot and then click on Next and put our device into DFU mode. DFU mode, it should identify and the process should begin and once this process is done our phone should successfully boot up and we would be able to use Cydia as we used to so user and it should we are forwarding this speeding up the video right here so it would leave us a comment down below what you think about this one this is a C from H for gadgets serving you now and then